The gentlewoman uh, is recognized without objection. Mr. Speaker, on Tuesday, despite the GOP's best efforts, health care exchanges across this country opened. In the first 24 hours, healthcare.gov was visited by 4.7 million visitors. In Massachusetts, where we've had an exchange for years, thousands began the process of signing up for expanded care. Yesterday, in one of the local papers in my district, the Lawrence Eagle Tribune, a reader wrote about the benefits that people are already enjoying under the Affordable Care Act. This grateful parent stated, quote, I have been happy with Obamacare. For the past two years, my two recent college grads have been on my insurance. We have saved over $4,000. Originally, one was kicked off our plan at age 22. Republicans say, young and healthy kids do not need insurance. They are wrong. One of our children was hit by a car walking, and the other had gallbladder surgery. The hospital bills were over $50,000. It is evident that families all over this country are grateful that their loved ones will have access to affordable health coverage. To my colleagues across the aisle, please listen to them. Gentlewoman's time has expired. For what purpose is the gentleman from Arizona seek recognition? Mr. Speaker, I ask unanimous.